What the fuck? Crap. I, I needed to unplug. I had to get away from my roommate, you know. Last time I had a roommate was Chuck Sheen at Promises in Malibu. I don't have a roommate either. I needed, I needed to think or not think. What are you stressing over? You're 12. You wanna talk it out? Unpopular opinion, youth makes stress worse, not better. Like, I don't know what the fuck I'm doing with a certain work matter. I don't know if I should trust myself. No, oh, a real problem, thus the Cheetos. Yeah. I found something on hypersonic, and it's bad. Full on, not good, bad. But Taylor doesn't want to hear that shit. That's been made abundantly clear. So I don't know what to do. I've already pushed. They are the genius, and I'm 12. But this time they're wrong. Is there a trade I can kill? Too late, it's locked. People who really know about investing, I'm not talking about cocktail party expert bullshitters like me, I mean real operators say, the bigger the position, the more stress there is on the research. And if that research shows a crack, you better fucking act on it ASAP. If you freeze in the moment, you're a corpse. I can do it for you. But the truth is, you can't let your boss eat a giant shit burger. In the end, they will blame you. You gotta have the courage to tell Taylor yourself. Is this like a way for you to sort of hedge your bet, this place? Because I was in a relationship a while back, we moved in together, but we each kept a locked drawer file cabinet in the name of privacy and independence. Some real Edgar Allan Poe shit started happening about what was in each other's drawer. I'm not gonna say that's why it didn't work out, but it didn't work out. I guess I'm saying hedging's for work, not this. And if I do it again, it'll be open drawers only, not locked. <laughs>